In this session, we are going to remote debug Spring Boot based REST web service. As you can see over here, I have a sample code, a public class Hello World application. It has one method, get input. It has get mapping annotation Spring Boot debug. The simple logic is it would create a Spring based REST web service which would be accessible via one URL. The URI pattern would be Spring Boot Debug. And this get input method has, and this get input method would be able to accept one request param called input. Now this particular Spring Boot Debug application has its jar file generated under this target directory. We need to run this particular jar in debug mode and we would try to connect to that running Spring Boot application from the editor. Here we are under the target directory of this Spring Boot debug application and I am going to run this particular jar file that is Spring Boot debug 0.0.1 snapshot.jar in debug mode. Important thing here is transport is dt underscore socket and address is 8001. So that would be the port to which we would be connecting while trying to remote debug this particular application. Now as we can see over here the embedded tomcat is started on port 8080. I would go back to IntelliJ editor, place a breakpoint over here and create the configuration for remote debugging. We can add the configuration from here or we can go to run, edit configuration, click here in the plus icon, select remote. We can see the debugger mode is attached to remote JVM. The transport is socket. We would keep as it is. The host name in this case as the application is running on local, it would be localhost. If it is a remote application with some IP, we can mention that IP. The port should be 8001 in our case. Let me provide a name to this particular configuration. Let me click on apply and OK and debug this particular application with this particular configuration. As we can see over here, it is connected to the target VM address is localhost colon 8001 and the transport is socket. Now let me try to access this particular web service from the browser. As you can see in the URL, we are trying to access the Spring based REST web service. The URI is localhost colon 8080 Spring Boot Debug. Input parameters value is hello remote REST debug. As you can see over here, once we have hit the URL in the browser, the breakpoint is hit at line number 27. If we go to this uh, input parameter, we can see hello remote rest debug means the parameter that we have passed has come here now we are all set for debugging so these are the simple steps to set up IntelliJ IDEA for debugging any remote application in our case it was a spring based rest web service which was created using spring boot but the principle is similar for any remote application we need to run that particular application with certain parameters and then we need to connect to that particular application using the source code from the IntelliJ editor. We need to create configurations for remote debugging and then connect for remote debugging.